Hi guys, good evening. I'm going to do your reading today. For everybody who's new, my name is Corinne, aka Corinne's Fire and Ice. Please like and subscribe. I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers. Let's see. The message is today. Nine of air. Expecting the worst, self-fulfilling prophecies, sleepless nights. If you guys need to pause the video to read the message, go right ahead. Balance, the need for balance and moderation. Cooperation and compromise, wait for perfect timing. Strength, great inner strength, release harsh judgments, forgiveness and compassion. The Empress. Lavish abundance. Give birth to your dreams. Nurture, nurture yourself and others. Release. The end of a phase or situation. Spiritual transformation. Time to move on. You have a bunch of major arcana here. Five of fire. Competing goals, bothersome details, conflict with others. Let's see. Six of air. Things are looking up. At the end of a difficult situation, taking a trip. Sorry, I didn't show you guys the last card. <clears throat> the emperor. Organization and logic, structure and discipline, leadership. Ace of Water, falling in love, or the resurgence of a relationship, spiritual growth, and enhanced intuition, a new home. Nine of Water, your wish comes true, concerns, fight, concerns fade away, I can't talk today, a love of life. So something is looking really, really good for you guys. It's going to be end the end of a, you know, maybe a bad situation, maybe something uh, in your home life is about to change for the better. Let me get some, let me see, a message also that maybe you need to work on or be aware of. Let's see. Cooperation instead of com competition. What's yours is yours, and no one can take it away from you. There's no need to compete, and there's an abundance for all. You have complete access to unlimited abundance for yourself and to share with others. With cooperative partnerships, you can accomplish anything. Quiet Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the outer world so that you can discern and process your true thoughts and feelings from your inner world. Create this quiet time for yourself and you'll have more clarity about what to do next. Have courage to ask for and accept help. Asking for help is a sign of strength as is accepting it, accepting it as it is offered to you. Very often, when you ask God for help, prayers are answered through other people. Be sure to accept the assistance as well as give it to others as you are guided. That's some great messages. Let's get some clarifying. <clears throat> Put these over here. Hopefully everybody's got their coffee for the evening or getting some. I know I did. I needed some. All right, let's see what we got here.
Yeah, this is a really good reading. If there was some serious tensions at home, the wheel is about to turn, though. As you know, karma is going to come around to people who have, you know, wronged you. Make sure to... Uh, yeah, stop sacrificing your own happiness in order to please others. Start reevaluating the situation. Yeah, there's going to be some movement getting out of that situation. So again, this looks like to be family life. So got to break free from any you know, negativity, no matter how you have to go about doing that, distance yourself, setting some boundaries. But yeah, once you move away from, you know, or take a step back from that, it seems everything will be great. Yeah, and don't, don't forget to ask, you know, people in your support system, for any advice, pray about things, can't express that enough. Don't hang on to people who, you know, don't serve, you know, the best in the situation. You know, if they're not serving you, or serving a purpose, I should say, rather, um, in your life, you know, you have to distance yourself. But yeah, there will be movements. There will be movement. And let's see a going away message here. Let's see what this says. Study and learning. Thank you, angels, for allowing me to see that every day is a learning day. It's cute. So with that, right, you just you're gonna learn from a situation. Well, all situations. Um, so, you know, take what you can from the situation. Don't forget to be grateful and thankful for what you already, you know, have accomplished, have known. The knowledge you get from other people and situations. You know, it seems really hard at times, but, you know, be thankful for these, for these times. They do teach you a lot. All right, guys. You guys have a great evening, and I will see you guys again soon.